What's up guys, Here's your Bear here. I got another EFT video for you today. Um, this time we're actually going on a night run through woods without night vision goggles. We're actually going without any gear, just going with our classic hatchet. I guess we'll do a hatchet run then, since my character doesn't want to bring anything, apparently. Maybe we'll be able to pull off some loot from some scabs or something. Or even if I could just get down to the bunker, get something from there, and then go from there. Got that key, so luckily if I spawn close, I can usually loot that weapon crate. And then if I get a weapon there, that's great. I usually don't have ammo for it, though, but who knows? We might get lucky. If not, we'll just have to sneak up on some unsuspecting scabs. Let's go. I'm trying to think like the best way it might just be to stick along the road. Either that or I could head towards Lumber Mill. I guess I'll go down towards the end of the road and then head towards Lumber Mill that way. Might be able to get behind some people. Anyone out here? How much time we got? Oh, okay, we got like the full raid. I kinda doubt I'm gonna run into any scavs over here though. I'm not even gonna bother checking that. It's probably already been checked anyway. Was that a flashlight? can't tell from here. Alright, give me a gun. Nope. Alright. Well. Alright then. Um make some money out of it at least. It's a nice uh, suppressor there. Sells for a decent chunk. Yet to see anyone though. Probably all lurking around Lumber Mill. I'm basically hoping at this point that there's no one with light night vision goggles. Otherwise, I'm gonna get caught. 
caught out easily. Even without him, Woods is never that dark. It's enough to give you a little bit of cover, but it's not gonna... It's not like Factory, where you're completely invisible in some points. Although it is a lot easier to catch up to Scavs. Or to get up to them without them seeing you. I doubt that I'll get anyone once I get down into Lumber Mill, just because... Is that a guy over there? I know where there's some scavs. Usually over here. Hopefully I don't get spotted out. Yep, there's one. I think it's a scab anyway. There's our victim. I'm not sure what weapon he's got. Not dead. He... Finally. What did he have on him? Holy crap, okay. I made way more noise than I needed to there. Did I even take any shots? No, I didn't. Alright. Reload this real quick. I think I've even got the right ammo for it. Do I? Okay. Yeah, okay. I always get these confused. Because I know the... Is it the Vepper? Or I know the AKS, I think, takes FMJ, something like that. Alright, I'm gonna see if I can make my way over towards the bunker. I got armor and stuff now, so... A little bit better off than when we started, I'd say. It'd be nice to get a backpack, though. Actually, before I get into a fight here... I don't like the rear sights on this. I think it blocks my view down the sights. I don't know why, though. I, it took a lot of hits to kill that scav. Must have been his armor or his helmet. Probably a combination of both. Took him way longer to fall than I thought it would have. Extractions. I think we just have that outskirts one. Yep. 
or the bunker if no one else is extracted there yet we might be able to hopefully there's no one camping this though We should be able to extract here, I would think. Alright. I get like an SS valve, anything, or just any gun actually. Looks like there's one here. Ooh! Alright. That's not a bad run. Even though there wasn't too much action, we got the one kill. Got out with a VSS, 2K XP, armor, and a helmet. Not too bad. If you guys like the video, don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.